Sam Ballard was 19 years old when friends at a party dared him to swallow a slug. Within days, the Australian teen developed a rare form of meningitis and fell into a coma that lasted more than a year. Even after waking up, he remains paralyzed from the neck down. The culprit, doctors said, was a parasite in the slug called a rat lungworm, which can burrow into the human brain. Ballard isn't alone, or even the only person infected on a dare, at least three reported cases involve boys or young men who were dared to eat a slug or snail. What's more, the parasite is now spreading to new places around the globe. Originally from Asia, rat lungworm is now found in Africa, Australia, the Caribbean, and the southern United States. In 2017, Hawaii stated they now have about 10 human cases of rat lungworm a year. Rat lungworms can live in a variety of snail and slug species, which show no obvious signs of infection, so it's impossible to know whether any animals you see outdoors are carriers. If you think about it, parasites want a host that will be eaten, and snails are food for lots of animals, including birds. They're also accidentally consumed by pets and other animals when the creatures get into drinking water. In Florida, the parasite has turned up in dogs, miniature horses, birds, and various wild animals. Once ingested lungworm heads for the brain. The worms are sometimes able to burrow through a human brain's protective outer barrier, but once inside, they can't get back out. That leaves worms burrowing in the brain, damaging it physically, as well as causing inflammation as the immune system fights back. When worms die in the brain, the inflammation can be even more intense, which is why doctors rarely treat the infection with drugs to kill the worms. Instead, doctors usually treat the symptoms and let the body's immune system do its work. It's rare for people infected with the parasite to develop severe meningitis, but it's often deadly when it happens. As you may have gathered by now, it's a bad idea to eat raw slugs or snails. The same goes for raw frogs and freshwater crabs and shrimp. Instead, you should boil such delicacies for at least three minutes or cook them to an internal temperature of 165 degrees Fahrenheit for at least 15 seconds to kill any worms. Even if you already think it's a no-brainer to avoid eating slugs on purpose, keep in mind that it's pretty easy to eat small ones accidentally and it's possible that the parasite could be carried in their slime trails. So make sure your vegetables are thoroughly washed if eaten raw. However, after saying all that, Terrestrial slugs and snails found on land, not in the sea, are generally safe for human consumption, always after a thorough cooking though, as we have stated. And their nutritional value certainly justifies the effort of collecting and preparing them. These critters have about 90 calories per 100 grams of meat, which is high in protein at 12 to 16 percent, and rich in minerals. However most people get a little squeamish at the thought of eating a slug or snail, so maybe you're just better off avoiding them. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please subscribe to this YouTube channel, and don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy this next video on our beavers dangerous to humans, pets and property. Thanks for watching and bye for now.